pray, my friend. You might be saying, I pray more often, but I run out of stuff to say. Hmm, I can certainly relate. To grow in the Lord, the reading and studying of God's word is essential. And so is prayer. In fact, prayer is one of the privileges we have as Christians. The Bible calls us to a life of faithful prayer, which isn't always easy. One of the best incentives to pray is that it strengthens us and short circuits our tendency to sin. Prayer also gives us strength and wisdom to follow through on the teachings in the Bible. If prayer is difficult for you, set aside a small amount of time for prayer every day. Gradually increase that time as you settle into this routine. And you can talk to God about anything. No question, no problem, no concern is too big or too small for him to handle. Lord, calm my spirit as I come to you with praise and share my concern. Give me the courage to talk to you and the patience to listen for your response. Amen. This is our one minute inspiration. And we've been talking about daily prayer and reading the word. Daily prayer and reading the word. Daily. And we got to set some time. Set a, a, some time, small amount of time daily. And as you continue to set a small amount of time daily, it will actually increase. Your desire and hunger shall grow. And you know, prayer is where the action is. It changes things. It's still popular. And we should do it on a regular basis. We should do it on a regular basis. Because you know what? Unlike people, we can talk to God about anything. No question, no problem, no concern is too big or too small for God. And you know what else God doesn't do? He doesn't go around being a talebearer and gossiping. He doesn't tell what your innermost secrets are. He keeps them private between you and him. That's what he does. God is a good God. He's a faithful God. We can trust God and put our confidence in the Lord. And guess what? When you're going through something, you can go to God in prayer and go to his word. and He'll calm your fears and calm you down. And if you're dealing and struggling with anxiety, he'll take care of that also. When you're feeling overwhelmed or that anxiety, just look to the Lord and start to pray. And you'll see prayer changes things. And it's where the action is. It works. God bless you all.